Hello guys and welcome back to yet another episode of Pokemon Avengers Red Chapter. Now the last episode we did some kind of ritual summon, I don't know what that was. We had to find the seven sins or something and we were the seven sin I guess and yeah it was just crazy. Go watch it. Yes I want to use a fucking ritual. Alright, but now we have to continue down here but before I do that I want to make a quick announcement. There were some Sun and Moon trailers recently, like what? Last week, yeah, it was last week, and I did not do any videos on them because from now on I do not want to make any more Sun and Moon videos. Not because I hate the game or anything, I just want to be a spoiler free channel from now on, and I don't want anything spoiled for me. Because there there have been a bunch of trailers and like, it's as if half of the game has already been revealed. So yeah, I'm not gonna do any more Sun and Moon news videos, so don't worry, I'm a spoiler free channel from now on. So let's continue down here. And I'm also thinking about starting a new series, but we have to finish this one first. But it's. <laughs> I kind of have this. I'm, I kind of think this is gonna be like, what, 100 episodes? This game is ridiculously long. I can help you, Pokemon, relearn moves. Yeah. Okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. Casper. Can you learn Sludge Bomb? Do you already have that or not? Okay. Let's see what we can learn. Okay. I don't think there's really anything. I've already done that. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, are you kidding me? Is this a glitch? I don't want to fucking learn a move. Stop it! The torturing. Oh my god. I, it's probably some kind of... Stupid thing where I have to do it. Oh, there we go. Okay, I got out of it. Cool, 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 cool. Let's continue. The fuck is this rock? Oh god. What? You shouldn't be here. You're supposed to be the boy who awakens our dark god. Well, I'm sorry, bro. I just don't feel like it. No, oh god. Nah, that's not gonna work. We need some physical attacks. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Do you have any? You don't. Well, then just stay in. Light screen. Well, that sucks. Flame throw. Did you just miss hammer arm? Thank you. Oh my god, are you kidding me? And that's it, Lazy. Thank you. Damn, that's an annoying battle. And don't worry, the team is gonna be like. Yeah, I will like redo the team, but only when we get to the Orange League. I've already told you that, I believe. Alright, why not just use this? Whatever. Alright. Not a trick, really. Now that god is said to be a fearsome being that once fought the moon. The moon? The hell? Who fights the moon? He's an idiot. Oh shit, this is actually not good. Wow, this fucking Gengar is weak as fuck. Just saying. I don't know why I said it like that. Ignored. Die, st Oh my god, Stami, stop it. Stami. 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 Stami! There we go. I can't even bother fucking reviving that stupid Casper. He's so weak. Well, it's only because he hasn't had any EVs, you know. He hasn't been trained properly. We caught him in the wild at that level, so... He's gonna be weak no matter what. Alright. Let's continue. Oh, that god is actually awake. But he's imprisoned by the moon. Oh, so that's why he fought. He fought the moon and lost. There we go. A Gallade. A Gallade. Okay, let's just mute you can handle this. Actually, you know what? Flamethrower. Give him that sunny day boost. Oh god. Ouch. 
Right. I have a potion. Do we have an elixir? I don't need that yet. Actually. Oh my god, all these trainers. Ice beam, team. And you both couldn't kill. How fucking fantastic. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I'm gonna surf. No, that, that doesn't make a difference. Fuck that. Stop surviving, you assholes. There we go. Ouch. Come on, come on. Oh, power whip. That's kind of fucking scary. Alright, full restore. And where's my full heals? And there we go. Alright, let's continue. I have a feeling we're about to battle some crazy shit, so... Let's continue now. Alright, we're still in the underworld. What's happening? Huh? We finally got you! What? The, what? Why can't I move? You're being ill by your blood infused with our magic. Now you can't move at all, can you? Can you? No, no, I need to get out of here. Oh fuck. Usually, a magic alone wouldn't have the power to hold a living person down. But you've been here long enough. You're starting to lose energy, am I right, boy? Ah, uh, you little piece of... Don't fault us for this. We're just like you. We just want to get out of this realm. You want to get out of this realm so badly that you're willingly... That you're willing to end another person's life? Yes! Ch Enough talk. Time to drain every ounce of your blood from your body. I think maybe by sick... By sick thing you like... Black the di liar? What the hell? Uh, no, no, help! Hey! Green! Ash! Are you guys... Of course we're still alive! Enough long, ERG. You need to stop Paragon now. Yeah, but are you gonna help me? Shh. Sweetie, we can't. Ash and I were stuck in this realm for way too long. We don't have much energy left to fight. We need our last remaining energy to, to defeat those two twits. You gotta do this yourself, Yuji. Our lives rest entirely on your hands. <sighs> we're out of breath, apparently. But we can still run. How long is this? Oh, God. This is it. This is it. No, you've ruined it! The hell? He's catching up again! Finish him, Yuji! The hell is going on? It's just Paragons. Okay. I hope nothing crazy happens. Oh god. Kill this mo- oh my god, no, 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 no. This is not gonna end well. Ouch. Stop doing that. How? Do you have no god? No, you don't. Thank fuck. Okay, good. Hey mom, this stupid Paragon C. Oh, of course you made it, the psychic type. That's fucking fair, right? God damn it. Fuck, what do I do? I guess I'm just gonna be on my issue. He's gonna one shot everything. Thank you. Yeah, now you get the attack boost, you. Sometimes, I don't. I don't know what to say. <sighs> We're running out of energy. This is not good. What the f Oh my fucking god, it's amazing no. What the hell is that? <laughs> the clip just probably ruined its wireframe. Oh my god, that's... I'm not even mad, that's fucking amazing. We get to battle missing no.
So what? Where is it a bird type or what? It should be weak to ice. What the hell? That did nothing. Okay, this is not gonna be... Oh my god, what is that? Hello? What? Are you kidding me? No, not one of these. Come on. Thank fuck. That is not luck. That is not a not luck. I would have lost at this point. I don't care. This is not a game to not luck. Okay, let's see what Psychic does. Arrow signal. Can we actually catch this thing? Are you kidding me? Can we? Oh, it's a train. I'm so stupid. I should have noticed that. I don't even know what's going on right now, guys. That's the fucking thing. I think we're gonna lose. This is not easy. So, normal is not very effective. What the hell? What is your type? Fucking cool. I love that. I love how stupid this game sometimes is. Oh my god. I can't be mad. It's a cool fucking thing. What's going on? Okay, that's just how it goes. Okay. So, I'll just cut it and we'll try and defeat him this time. Alright guys, we're back. I had to fight Paragon C again, but that I don't think that's very interesting, so let's see what happens this time. This time I, I've come prepared, let me say that. I have a little surprise for missing no here, for ruining my old green game. Yeah, that's right, I don't know what was wrong. I, I was playing it like Pokemon Green, although I couldn't because of missing no. I still insisted on starting over all the time. Don't know why. Okay, so see, that's the move that's gonna kill us. But if you have a ghost type with destiny bond, that's not gonna matter. I'm taking you with me, missing no. Deal with it. He fell forward. I'm just saying. What can I do? I'm just playing like he is. If he wanted to cheat, if he is going to cheat with a one-hit KO move that always hits, I'm gonna destiny bond him. Bitch. Got him! Thank God. Or oh, thank me. It wasn't it was really me, but whatever. Thank Casper. It's too strong. Fuck is the same. What's happening? The, a Pikachu? No way, you're you're Ash Pikachu. What? I never thought I'll see my true form again. So Paragon was Ash Pikachu all this time? How does that even work? I'll tell you how. When I started my journey with Ash, I hated that kid's gut. He was naive, pathetic, and too mushy for my taste. I knew from the start that he's one of those childish trainers who would give up the moment things get tough. But I was wrong. Don't get me wrong, he was naive, pathetic, and mushy. But, but he never gave up. In the Viridian City Pokemon Center, when Team Rocket attacked us, he gave it us all to protect me. In turn, I didn't give up protecting him. Unfortunately, I died from that incident. I realized that I misjudged the boy, misjudged the boy, but it was too late. The shock from my death placed him in a deep coma. During the time of my death, Silvco was creating their first artificial Pokemon, Paragon. They wanted to create a Pokemon that can express true emotions. To do this, they've created how we are called Soul Net. Soul Net can transfer pre existing soul of a deceased Pokemon into an AI file. My soul was downloaded into a disk and was installed into the very first Paragon. However, due to the unforeseen glitches of the Soul Net hardware, I was given powers that rivaled that of a legendary Pokemon. Obviously, the scientists were scared and locked me up. That was until I was released by the three of you. When you destroyed the Silvco building. Oh shit. Then why did you do all this? Why didn't you just reunite with your trainer? 
because I want to pay back for everything he had ever done for me. I have so much power, but even I can't release a person from their mind. I was a horrible Pokemon, and I didn't deserve a trainer like your son. I had to wake him up from his coma or keep his memories alive. Everything was working fine. He made friends and he was happy. Was that why you didn't hurt me in the beginning? Because I was Ash's only friend? Yes, but there was a problem. I don't have enough power. The real Ash is slowly dying in the hospital bed. I couldn't keep up the illusion, and that is why I started looking. And that's why I started draining life energy from anyone I saw. But that wasn't enough, was it? No, even after absorbing people's life energy or evolving, I still can't prevent them from dying. That's when I remembered about the Soulnet hardware. I wanted to upload the entire universe into the internet. That way, I can keep Ash's memories and spirit alive forever. But I failed. Just let it go. Huh? Miss Ketchum? I understand where you're coming from. I've lost the love of my life, and the thought of losing my son was too much for me as well. However, when Ash ended his own life, shows that he does not want any of this to happen. Damn. What? Ash! <gasps> Green! It's okay. Don't walk him back to the real world. You'll be back there shortly too. What's gonna happen to you? My Paragon's wireframe has been destroyed. My spirits can no longer venture to the human world. This is the last time I'll ever see you guys. Goodbye. If you ever see Ash again, please tell him I'm proud of him. <laughs> you failed. What the hell? I may have failed, but I gained something in the end. Oh, let me guess. Love. No, closure. That's something you're not familiar with. You can't use me as a pawn anymore. I never counted on you anyway. There's still that girl left in the human world. What's her name again? Oh right, Carly. It's your plans aren't going to work. Darkrai. Holy shit. We'll see about that. I will get out of this dimension. What the freak is going on? Okay, you've lost. Suda Janai, What the hell? How does it feel to be alive again? Not even remotely funny. You never laugh at anything. Jaren's cup is starting in two weeks. Really? You're pathetic. It's at Pumalu Island. I'll see you there, Yuchi. You better bring your A-game. Yuchi, I'm not planning to lose to you again. Deal. It's green. Really? This enigma barrel can raise my Pokemon stats to level 100? Teehee, yes. I'm going to sell it for 5,000. That's a bit too expensive. Hmm. Okay then. I guess I'll sell it to the shop owner in Tankle Island. <laughs> God damn. Wait, I'll take it. Say, thank you. Got to be doing business with you. God damn it, Green. Oh, hi, sweetie. Are you here to say goodbye? <sighs> I guess you're back to your old ways again. I need money to survive too, you know. Whatever. Anyway, the Orange Cup is starting in two weeks. Are you going to take part in the championship? Nope. What? You're not, sweetie. I'm not like you. I'm not like you. The champion title doesn't really hold any place in my heart. Goodbye, Yuji. We won't be seeing each other for a very long time. Where are you going? I'm going to leave for the Nomi region. Okay, it's a paradise there. Oh, okay. Good luck, Green. Damn, all these characters we have to meet. With Ivy, how are you feeling? Much better, Yuji. Thanks for asking. How have you been enjoying your stay in the Orange Archipelago? I gotta say, it's pretty interesting. There's so many Pokemon here that doesn't exist in Kano. Yeah, the Orange Archipelago is unique like that. I'm just excited about the Orange Cup. <laughs> oh right, I forgot that you were here to take part in the Orange Cup. You're going to be great. I'm rooting for you. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Ivy. Oh my god, all this story. Okay, Miss Ketchum. Oh, hello, Yuji. What are you doing here? I'm just here to apologize to Professor Ivy. It was my fault that she was hurt. I'm sorry about Ash, Miss Kitchen. It's okay. It's not your fault. Even though the Ash I saw again is just a projection created by Paragon from Ash's memories. He was the son I have known and loved. Seeing him and hearing what he wants is what I needed to finally move on. 
Are you going to head back to Kano? No. I'm going to leave Kano. I'm moving to the Kalos region. Hello? I'm going to live with my sister and her family for a while. Oh, okay. I wish you all the best, Miss Ketchum. Goodbye, Yuji. Holy story. Okay. So... A bunch of crazy stuff just happened, to be honest. And we finally got... Well, what can I say? Well, I can't say because I wanted to say we finally got the last straw of the story, but we still have the orange cup to go. But yeah, that was definitely the main plot finished. Kind of. Because... We finally found out who Porygon was. But then again, we have a new threat. Kali and Darkrai. And Darkrai is apparently the main bad guy. No, don't use another pill. So yeah, all this story just have to get into my head because that was a bit much. But we did it, guys. We finally solved that stupid mystery. And let me just move Casper out of the way because we don't need him. You can go there. There we go. Okay. That was definitely some story. I'll admit that. But yeah. That's actually gonna be it for this episode. I was planning on making this episode a long episode, but... This is just... This seems like a perfect time to end it on. And I'm gonna go find... Pumelo Island. And yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe as it helps out a lot. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Or video. Whatever you wanna say. Goodbye.